Rajasthan Hindustani pronunciation, Radis Tn listen, literally, land of kings, is a state in northern India. The state covers an area of 342,239 square kilometres 132,139 square miles or 10.4% of the total geographical area of India. It is the largest Indian state by area and the seventh largest by population. Rajasthan is located on the northwestern side of India, where it comprises most of the wide and inhospitable Thar Desert also known as the Rajasthan Desert and Great Indian Desert, and shares a border with the Pakistani provinces of Punjab to the northwest and Sindh to the west, along the Sutlej Indus River Valley. Elsewhere it is bordered by five other Indian states, Punjab to the north, Haryana and Uttar Pradesh to the northeast, Madhya Pradesh to the southeast, and Gujarat to the southwest. Major features include the ruins of the Indus Valley Civilization at Kalibanga, the Dilwara Temples, a Jain pilgrimage site at Rajasthan's only hill station, Mount Abu, in the ancient Aravalli mountain range, and, in eastern Rajasthan, the Kaoladeo National Park near Bharatpur, a World Heritage Site known for its bird life. Rajasthan is also home to three national tiger reserves, the Ranthambhor National Park in Sawai Madhapur, Sarishka Tiger Reserve in Alwar and Mukundra Hill Tiger Reserve in Kota. The state was formed on 30 March 1949 when Rajputana, the name adopted by the British Raj for its dependencies in the region, was merged into the Dominion of India. Its capital and largest city is Jaipur. Other important cities are Jodhpur, Kota, Bikaner, Ajmer and Udaipur. Etymology Rajasthan literally means, ''Land of Kings'' or ''King's Abode'' from Raja king", and Stan Land, Abode from Sanskrit sth na. The first mention of the name, ''Rajasthan'' appears in the 1829 publication Annals and Antiquities of Rajasthan or the Central and Western Rajput states of India, while the earliest known record of Rajputana. As a name for the region is in George Thomas's 1800 memoir Military Memories. John Key, in his book India, A History, stated that, Rajputana was coined by the British in 1829. John Briggs, translating Farishta's History of Early Islamic India, used the phrase, Rajput, Rajput princes, rather than Indian princes. History Ancient Parts of what is now Rajasthan were partly part of the Vedic civilization and Indus Valley civilization. Kalibangan, in Hanumangar district, was a major provincial capital of the Indus Valley civilization. Stone Age tools dating from 5000 to 2000 years were found in Bundi and Bulwara districts of the state. Matsya Kingdom of the Vedic civilization of India is said to roughly correspond to the former state of Jaipur in Rajasthan and included the whole of Alwar with portions of Bharatpur. The capital of Matsya was at Viratnagar, modern Bairat, which is said to have been named after its founder King Virata. Bhargava identifies the two districts of Junjunu and Sikhar and parts of Jaipur district along with Haryana districts of Mahendragar and Rewari as part of Vedic state of Brahmavarta. Bhargava also locates the present day Sahibi River as the Vedic Drishawati River, which along with Saraswati River formed the borders of the Vedic state of Brahmavarta. Manu and Brigu narrated the Manumriti to a congregation of seers in this area only. Ashrams of Vedic seers Brigu and his son Chavan Rishi, for whom Chiawanprash was formulated, were near Dosi Hill part of which lies in Dosi village of Junjunu district of Rajasthan and part lies in Mahendragar district of Haryana. The western Shatrapas 405 to 35 BC, the Saka rulers of the western part of India, were successors to the Indo-Scythians, and were contemporaneous with the Kushans, who ruled the northern part of the Indian subcontinent. The Indo-Scythians invaded the area of Ujjain and established the Saka era with their calendar, marking the beginning of the long-lived Saka western satrap state. Classical Gurjars 
Gurjars ruled for many dynasties in this part of the country, the region was known as Gurjaratra. Up to the 10th century AD, almost all of North India acknowledged the supremacy of the Gurjars, with their seat of power at Kannauj. Gurhara <laughs> Pratihara The Gurra Pratihar Empire acted as a barrier for Arab invaders from the 8th to the 11th century. The chief accomplishment of the Gurhara Pratihara Empire lies in its successful resistance to foreign invasions from the West, starting in the days of Junaid. Historian R. C. Majumdar says that this was openly acknowledged by the Arab writers. He further notes that historians of India have wondered at the slow progress of Muslim invaders in India, as compared with their rapid advance in other parts of the world. Now there seems little doubt that it was the power of the Gurhara Pratihara army that effectively barred the progress of the Arabs beyond the confines of Sindh, their only conquest for nearly 300 years. <inaudible> medieval and early modern Historical <inaudible> 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 tribes <inaudible> 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 Traditionally the Rajputs, Gurjars, Jats, Minas, Bills, Rajparahit, Sharans, Yadavs, Bishnua, Meghwal, Sirmals, Fulmali Saini, and other tribes made a great contribution in building the state of Rajasthan. All these tribes suffered great difficulties in protecting their culture and the land. Millions of them were killed trying to protect their land. Bills once ruled Kota. Minas were rulers of Bundi, Hadoti and the Dindhar region. Major rulers Hemu, the Hindu emperor, was born in the village of Makhari in Alwar district in 1501. He won 22 battles against Afghans, from Punjab to Bengal including states of Ajmer and Alwar in Rajasthan, and defeated Akbar's forces twice at Agra and Delhi in 1556 at Battle of Delhi before acceding to the throne of Delhi and establishing the Hindu Raj. In North India, albeit for a short duration, from Purana Quila in Delhi. Hem Chandra was killed in the battlefield at Second Battle of Panipat fighting against Mughals on 5 November 1556. Maharana Pratap of Mewar resisted Akbar in the famous Battle of Haldagati and later operated from hilly areas of his kingdom. The Bills were Maharana's main allies during these wars. Most of these attacks were repulsed even though the Mughal forces outnumbered Mewar Rajputs in all the wars fought between them. The Haldagati War was fought between 10,000 Mewaris and a 100,000 strong Mughal force including many Rajputs like Kachwahas from Dindhar. Jat King Maharaja Siraj Mal February 1707 to the 25th of December 1764 or Sujan Singh was ruler of Bharatpur in Rajasthan. A contemporary historian has described him as the Plato of the Jat people, and by a modern writer as the Jat Odysseus, because of his political sagacity, steady intellect, and clear vision. Topic: <inaudible> Rajput martial history. Rajput families rose to prominence in the sixth century CE. The Rajputs put up resistance to the Islamic invasions with their warfare and chivalry for centuries. During the 12th century, the Turks and Afghans were able to get a firm grip on Punjab, Delhi and Bengal. The Ranas of Mewar led other kingdoms in its resistance to outside rule. Rana Hammer Singh, defeated the Tughlaq dynasty and recovered a large portion of Rajasthan. The indomitable Rana Kumba defeated the sultans of Malwa and Gujarat and made Mewar the most powerful Rajput kingdom in India. The ambitious Rana Sangha united the various Rajput clans and fought against the foreign powers in India. Rana Sangha defeated the Afghan Lodi Empire of Delhi and crushed the Turkic Sultanates of Malwa and Gujarat. Rana Sangha then tried to create an Indian Empire but was defeated by the first Mughal Emperor Babur at Kanua. The defeat was due to betrayal by the Tomar King Silhadi of Raisin. After Rana Sangha's death, there was no one who could check the rapid expansion of the Mughal Empire. During Akbar's reign, most of the Rajput kings accepted Mughal suzerainty, but the rulers of Mewar Rana Uday Singh II and Marwar Rao Rathor refused to have any form of alliance with the Mughals. 
To teach the Rajputs a lesson Akbar attacked Uday Singh and killed Rajput commander Jamal of Chatur and the citizens of Mewar in large numbers. Akbar killed 20-25,000 unarmed citizens in Chittor on the grounds that they had actively helped in the resistance. Maharana Pratap took an oath to avenge the citizens of Chittor. He fought the Mughal Empire till his death and liberated most of Mewar apart from Chittor itself. Maharana Pratap soon became the most celebrated warrior of Rajasthan and became famous all over India for his sporadic warfare and noble actions. According to Satish Chandra, Rana Pratap's defiance of the mighty Mughal Empire, almost alone and unaided by the other Rajput states, constitutes a glorious saga of Rajput valour and the spirit of self-sacrifice for cherished principles. Rana Pratap's methods of sporadic warfare was later elaborated further by Malik Ambar, the Dakani general, and by Shivaji. Rana Amar Singh I continued his ancestors' war against the Mughals under Jahangir, he repelled the Mughal armies at Duer. Later an expedition was again sent under leadership of Prince Karam, which caused much damage to life and property of Mewar. Many temples were destroyed, several villages were put on fire and ladies and children were captured and tortured to make Amar Singh accept surrender. During Aurangzeb's rule Rana Raj Singh I and Veer Durgadas Rathor were chief among those who defied the intolerant emperor of Delhi. They took advantage of the Aravalli Hills and caused heavy damage on the Mughal armies that were trying to occupy Rajasthan. After Aurangzeb's death, Bahadur Shah I tried to subjugate Rajasthan like his ancestors, but his plan backfired when the three Rajput Rajas of Amber, Udaipur, and Jodhpur made a joint resistance to the Mughals. The Rajputs first expelled the commandants of Jodhpur and Bayana and recovered Amer by a night attack. They next killed Sayyid Hussain Khan Barha, the commandant of Mu'at and many other Mughal officers. Bahadur Shah I, then in the Deccan was forced to patch up a truce with the Rajput Rajas. Over the years, the Mughals began to have internal disputes which greatly distracted them at times. The Mughal Empire continued to weaken, and with the decline of the Mughal Empire in the late 18th century, Rajputana came under the influence of the Marathas. The Maratha Empire, which had replaced the Mughal Empire as the overlord of the subcontinent, was finally replaced by the British Empire in 1818. In the 19th century the Rajput kingdoms were exhausted, they had been drained financially and in manpower after continuous wars and due to heavy tributes exacted by the Maratha Empire. In order to save their kingdoms from instability, rebellions and banditry the Rajput kings concluded treaties with the British in the early 19th century, accepting British suzerainty and control over their external affairs in return for internal autonomy. <laughs> <laughs> Modern Modern Rajasthan includes most of Rajputana, which comprises the erstwhile 19 princely states, two chiefships, and the British district of Ajmer Marwara. Jaisalmer, Marwar Jodhpur, Bikaner, Mewar Chittorgar, Alwar and Dinhar Jaipur were some of the main Rajput princely states. Bharatpur and Dolpur were Jat princely states whereas Tonk was a princely state under a Muslim Nawab. Rajasthan's formerly independent kingdoms created a rich architectural and cultural heritage, seen even today in their numerous forts and palaces, mahals and havelis, which are enriched by features of Rajput and Jain architecture. The development of frescoes in Rajasthan is linked with the history of the Marwaris, Jodhpur Pali, who played a crucial role in the economic development of the region. Topic: <laughs> Geography. <laughs> The geographic features of Rajasthan are the Thar Desert and the Aravalli Range, which runs through the state from southwest to northeast, almost from one end to the other, for more than 850 kilometers (530 miles). Mount Abu lies at the southwestern end of the range, separated from the main ranges by the West Banas River, although a series of broken ridges continues into Haryana in the direction of Delhi, where it can be seen as outcrops in the form of the Raisana Hill and the ridges farther north. About three-fifths of Rajasthan lies northwest of the Aravallis, leaving two-fifths on the east and south direction. The northwestern portion of Rajasthan is generally sandy and dry. Most of this region is covered by the Thar Desert which extends into adjoining portions of Pakistan. The Aravalli Range does not intercept the moisture giving southwest monsoon winds off the Arabian Sea, as it lies in a direction parallel to that of the coming monsoon winds, leaving the northwestern region in a rain shadow. 
The Thar Desert is thinly populated. The town of Jodhpur is the largest city in the desert and known as the Gateway of Thar Desert. The desert has some major districts like Jodhpur, Jaisalmer, Barmer, Bikaner, and Nagore. This area is also important defence point of view. Jodhpur Airbase is India's largest airbase and military, BSF bases are also situated here. A single civil airport is also situated in Jodhpur. The northwestern thorn scrub forests lie in a band around the Thar Desert, between the desert and the Aravallis. This region receives less than 400 mm of rain in an average year. Temperatures can sometimes exceed 54 degrees Celsius in the summer months or 129 degrees Fahrenheit and drop below freezing in the winter. The Godwar, Marwar, and Shekhawadi regions lie in the thorn scrub forest zone, along with the city of Jodhpur. The Luni River and its tributaries are the major river system of Godwar and Marwar regions, draining the western slopes of the Aravallis and emptying southwest into the Great Ran of Kutch wetland in neighboring Gujarat. This river is saline in the lower reaches and remains potable only up to Balotara in Barmer district. The Gagar River, which originates in Haryana, is an intermittent stream that disappears into the sands of the Thar Desert in the northern corner of the state and is seen as a remnant of the primitive Sarasvati River. The Aravalli Range and the lands to the east and southeast of the range are generally more fertile and better watered. This region is home to the Kathiawar Gur dry deciduous forests ecoregion, with tropical dry broadleaf forests that include teak, acacia, and other trees. The hilly Vigad region, home to the cities of Dungarpur and Banswara lies in southernmost Rajasthan, on the border with Gujarat and Madhya Pradesh. With the exception of Mount Abu, Vigad is the wettest region in Rajasthan, and the most heavily forested. North of Vigad lies the Mewar region, home to the cities of Udaipur and Chittorgar. The Hadoti region lies to the southeast, on the border with Madhya Pradesh. North of Hadoti and Mewar lies the Dindhar region, home to the state capital of Jaipur. Muat, the easternmost region of Rajasthan, borders Haryana and Uttar Pradesh. Eastern and southeastern Rajasthan is drained by the Banas and Chambal rivers, tributaries of the Ganges. The Aravalli Range runs across the state from the southwest peak Guru Shikar, Mount Abu, which is 1,722 meters (5,650 feet) in height, to Khetri in the northeast. This range divides the state into 60% in the northwest of the range and 40% in the southeast. The northwest tract is sandy and unproductive with little water but improves gradually from desert land in the far west and northwest to comparatively fertile and habitable land towards the east. The area includes the Thar Desert. The southeastern area, higher in elevation 100 to 350 meters above sea level and more fertile, has a very diversified topography, in the south lies the hilly tract of Mewar. In the southeast, a large area within the districts of Kota and Bundi forms a tableland. To the northeast of these districts is a rugged region, Badlands following the line of the Chambal River. Farther north the country levels out, the flat plains of the northeastern Bharatpur district are part of an alluvial basin. Merda city lies in the geographical center of Rajasthan. Topic: <inaudible> Flora and fauna. Though a large percentage of the total area is desert with little forest cover, Rajasthan has a rich and varied flora and fauna. The natural vegetation is classed as northern desert thorn forest, Champion 1936. These occur in small clumps scattered in a more or less open form. The density and size of patches increase from west to east following the increase in rainfall. The Desert National Park in Jaisalmer is spread over an area of 3,162 square kilometers 1,221 square miles, is an excellent example of the ecosystem of the Thar Desert and its diverse fauna. Seashells and massive fossilized tree trunks in this park record the geological history of the desert. The region is a haven for migratory and resident birds of the desert. One can see many eagles, harriers, falcons, buzzards, kestrels and vultures. Short-toed snake eagles Circetus gallicus, tawny eagles Aquila ripax, spotted eagles Aquila clanga, lagger falcons Falco jugger, and kestrels are the commonest of these. The Ranthambhor National Park located in Sawai Madhapur, one of the well-known tiger reserves in the country, became a part of Project Tiger in 1973. 
The Dosi Hill located in the district of Junjunu, known as Chavan Rishi's Ashram, where Chiawanprash was formulated for the first time, has unique and rare herbs growing. The Sarishka Tiger Reserve located in Alwar district, 200 km 120 miles from Delhi and 107 km 66 miles from Jaipur, covers an area of approximately 800 square kilometers 310 square miles. The area was declared a national park in 1979. Tall Chapur Sanctuary is a very small sanctuary in Sujangar, Churu district, 210 km 130 miles from Jaipur in the Shekhawati region. This sanctuary is home to a large population of blackbuck. Desert foxes and the caracal, an apex predator, also known as the desert lynx, can also be spotted, along with birds such as the partridge and sand grouse. The great Indian bustard, known locally as the Godavan, and which is a state bird, has been classed as critically endangered since 2011. <inaudible> <inaudible> wildlife protection Rajasthan is also noted for its national parks and wildlife sanctuaries. There are four national park and wildlife sanctuaries, Kaoladeo National Park of Bharatpur, Sarishka Tiger Reserve of Alwar, Ranthambore National Park of Sawai Madhapur, and Desert National Park of Jaisalmer. A national level institute, Arid Forest Research Institute and Autonomous Institute of the Ministry of Forestry is situated in Jodhpur and continuously work on desert flora and their conservation. Ranthambore National Park is 7 km from Sawai Madhapur Railway Station, it is known worldwide for its tiger population and is considered by both wilderness lovers and photographers as one of the best place in India to spot tigers. At one point, due to poaching and negligence, tigers became extinct at Sarishka, but five tigers have been relocated there. Prominent among the wildlife sanctuaries are Mount Abu Sanctuary, Benzrod Gar Sanctuary, Dara Sanctuary, Jaisaman Sanctuary, Kumbalgar Wildlife Sanctuary, Jawahar Sagar Sanctuary, and Sita Mata Wildlife Sanctuary. Communication Major ISP and telecom companies are present in Rajasthan including Airtel, Data Infosys Limited, Reliance Limited, Geo, RAILTEL, Software Technology Parks of India STPI, Tata Telecom and Vodafone. Data Infosys was the first internet service provider ISP to bring internet in Rajasthan in April 1999 and Oasis was first private mobile telephone company. Government and politics The politics of Rajasthan is dominated mainly by the Bharatiya Janata Party and the Indian National Congress. The chief minister, serving the second term, is Vasand Hara Rajay. Administrative divisions Rajasthan is divided into 33 districts within seven divisions. Economy Rajasthan's economy is primarily agricultural and pastoral. Wheat and barley are cultivated over large areas, as are pulses, sugarcane, and oilseeds. Cotton and tobacco are the state's cash crops. Rajasthan is among the largest producers of edible oils in India and the second largest producer of oilseeds. Rajasthan is also the biggest wool producing state in India and the main opium producer and consumer. There are mainly two crop seasons. The water for irrigation comes from wells and tanks. The Indira Gandhi Canal irrigates northwestern Rajasthan. The main industries are mineral based, agriculture based, and textile based. Rajasthan is the second largest producer of polyester fiber in India. Several prominent chemical and engineering companies are located in the city of Kota, in southern Rajasthan. Rajasthan is preeminent in quarrying and mining in India. The Taj Mahal was built from the white marble which was mined from a town called Makrana. The state is the second largest source of cement in India. It has rich salt deposits at Sambar, copper mines at Khetri, Junjunu, and zinc mines at Dariba, Zawar mines and Rampora Agucha open cast near Bulwara. Dimensional stone mining is also undertaken in Rajasthan. 
Jodhpur sandstone is mostly used in monuments, important buildings and residential buildings. This stone is termed as Chitter Padhar. Jodhpur leads in handicraft and guar gum industry. Rajasthan is also a part of the Mumbai-Delhi Industrial Corridor is set to benefit economically. The state gets 39% of the DMIC, with major districts of Jaipur, Alwar, Kota and Bulwara benefiting. Crude oil and mineral stones Rajasthan is earning 150 million rupees approximately 2.5 million dollars per day as revenue from the crude oil sector. This earning is expected to reach 250 million rupees per day in 2013, which is an increase of 100 million rupees or more than 66%. The government of India has given permission to extract 300,000 barrels of crude per day from Barmer region, which is now 175,000 barrels per day. Once this limit is achieved Rajasthan will become a leader in crude extraction in country. Bombay High leads with a production of 250,000 barrels crude per day. Once the limit of 300,000 barrels per day is reached, the overall production of the country will increase by 15%. Cairn India is doing the work of exploration and extraction of crude oil in Rajasthan. Rajasthan also has reserves of low silica limestone. Agricultural production Rajasthan is the largest producer of barley, mustard, pearl millet, coriander, fenugreek, and guar in India. Bamasa Mandi in Kota district is the Asia's largest mandi or market of coriander. Rajasthan produces over 72% of guar of the world and 60% of India's barley. Rajasthan is major producer of aloe vera, amla, oranges, leading producer of maize, groundnut. Rajasthan is second in production of cumin, gram and third in seed spices. Rajasthan government had initiated olive cultivation with technical support from Israel. The current production of olives in the state is around 100 to 110 tons annually. Rajasthan is India's second largest producer of milk. Rajasthan has 13,800 dairy cooperative societies. Topic Transport Rajasthan is connected by many national highways. Most renowned being NH8, which is India's first four to eight lane highway. Rajasthan also has an inter city surface transport system both in terms of railways and bus network. All chief cities are connected by air, rail, and road. Air there are six main airports at Rajasthan, Jaipur International Airport, Jodhpur Airport, Udaipur Airport and the recently started Ajmer Airport, Bikaner Airport and Jaisalmer. These airports connect Rajasthan with the major cities of India such as Delhi and Mumbai. There is another airport in Kota but is not open for commercial, civilian flights yet. Rail Rajasthan is connected with the main cities of India by rail. Jaipur, Kota, Ajmer, Jodhpur, Bharatpur, Bikaner, Alwar, Abu Road and Udaipur are the principal railway stations in Rajasthan. Kota city is the only electrified section served by three Rajdhani expresses and trains to all major cities of India. There is also an international railway, the Thar Express from Jodhpur India to Karachi Pakistan. however, this is not open to foreign nationals. Road Rajasthan is well connected to the main cities of the country including Delhi, Ahmedabad and Indore by state and national highways and served by Rajasthan State Road Transport Corporation RSRTC and private operators. Now in March 2017, 75% of all national highways being built in Rajasthan according to the Public Works Minister of Rajasthan. Demographics. According to final results of 2011 Census of India, Rajasthan has a total population of 68,548,437. The native Rajasthani people make up the majority of the state's population. The state of Rajasthan is also populated by Sindhis, who came to Rajasthan from Sindh province now in Pakistan during the India-Pakistan separation in 1947. As for religion, Rajasthan's residents are mainly Hindus, who account for 88.49% of the population. Muslims make up 9.07%, Sikhs 1.27% and Jains 0.91% of the population.
Topic: <laughs> Language. Hindi is the official and the most widely spoken language in the state 90.97% of the population as per the 2001 census, followed by Bihili 4.60%, Punjabi 2.01%, and Urdu 1.17%. Rajasthani is one of the main spoken languages in the state. Rajasthani and various Rajasthani dialects are counted under Hindi in the national census. In the 2001 census, Standard Rajasthani had over 18 million speakers, as well as millions of other speakers of Rajasthani dialects, such as Marwari. The languages taught under the three-language formula are, first language, Hindi Second language, English Third language, Gujarati, Punjabi, Sanskrit, Sindhi or Urdu Culture. Rajasthan is culturally rich and has artistic and cultural traditions which reflect the ancient Indian way of life. There is rich and varied folk culture from villages which are often depicted as a symbol of the state. Highly cultivated classical music and dance with its own distinct style is part of the cultural tradition of Rajasthan. The music has songs that depict day-to-day -day relationships and chores, often focused around fetching water from wells or ponds. Rajasthani cooking was influenced by both the warlike lifestyles of its inhabitants and the availability of ingredients in this arid region. Food that could last for several days and could be eaten without heating was preferred. The scarcity of water and fresh green vegetables have all had their effect on the cooking. It is known for its snacks like beaconary bujia. Other famous dishes include baira ki roti millet bread and lasun ki chutney hot garlic paste, mava kachori mirchi bada, piaj kachori and gever from Jodhpur, alwar ka mava milk cake, kadi kachori from Ajmer, malpawas from Pushkar, dal kachori kota kachori from Kota and rasgoyas from Bikaner. Originating from the Marwar region of the state is the concept Marwari Bijnalaya, or vegetarian restaurants, today found in many parts of India, which offer vegetarian food of the Marwari people. Dal Badi Churma is very popular in Rajasthan. The traditional way to serve it is to first coarsely mash the bati then pour pure ghee on top of it. It is served with the dal lentils and spicy garlic chutney. Also served with besan gram flour ki kadi. It is commonly served at all festivities, including religious occasions, wedding ceremonies, and birthday parties in Rajasthan. Dal bati churma is a combination of three different food items dal, lentils, bati, and churma. Sweet. It is a typical Rajasthani dish. The Goomer dance from Jodhpur Marwar and Kalbelia dance of Jaisalmer have gained international recognition. Folk music is a large part of Rajasthani culture. Kathputli, Bopa, Chong, Taratali, Ginder, Kachhayori, and Tajaji are examples of traditional Rajasthani culture. Folk songs are commonly ballads which relate heroic deeds and love stories, and religious or devotional songs known as bhajans and banis, which are often accompanied by musical instruments like dolak, sitar, and sarangi are also sung. Rajasthan is known for its traditional, colorful art. The block prints, tie and dye prints, bagaru prints, sanganer prints, and zari embroidery are major export products from Rajasthan. Handicraft items like wooden furniture and crafts, carpets, and blue pottery are commonly found here. Shopping reflects the colorful culture. Rajasthani clothes have a lot of mirror work and embroidery. A Rajasthani traditional dress for females comprises an ankle length skirt and a short top, also known as a lehenga or a chaniya choli. A piece of cloth is used to cover the head, both for protection from heat and maintenance of modesty. Rajasthani dresses are usually designed in bright colors like blue, yellow and orange. The main religious festivals are Deepawali, Holi, Gangor, Tej, Gogaji, Sri Devnarayan Janti, Makar Sankranti and Janmashtami, as the main religion is Hinduism. Rajasthan's desert festival is held once a year during winter. Dressed in costumes, the people of the desert dance and sing ballads. There are fairs with snake charmers, puppeteers, acrobats and folk performers. Camels play a role in this festival. Education During recent years, Rajasthan has worked on improving education. The state government has been making sustained efforts to raise the education standard.
Topic: Literacy. In recent decades, the literacy rate of Rajasthan has increased significantly. In 1991, the state's literacy rate was only 38.55% 54.99% male and 20.44% female. In 2001, the literacy rate increased to 60.41% 75.70% male and 43.85% female. This was the highest leap in the percentage of literacy recorded in India the rise in female literacy being 23%. At the census 2011, Rajasthan had a literacy rate of 67.06% 80.51% male and 52.66% female. Although Rajasthan's literacy rate is below the national average of 74.04% and although its female literacy rate is the lowest in the country, the state has been praised for its efforts and achievements in raising literacy rates. In rural areas of Rajasthan, the literacy rate is 76.16% for males and 45.8% for females. This has been debated across all the party level except BJP, when the governor of Rajasthan set a minimum educational qualification for the village panchayat elections. <laughs> <laughs> Schools Rajasthan has 55,000 primary and 7,400 secondary schools. Topic. Higher education In Rajasthan, Kota, Sikhar, Jodhpur are major education hubs. Kota is known for its quality education in preparation for competitive exams, coaching for medical and engineering exams, while Jodhpur is home to many higher education institutions like IIT, AIIMS, National Law University, Sardar Patel Police University, National Institute of Fashion Technology, MBM Engineering College etc. Kota is popularly referred to as, "...coaching capital of India." Other major education institutions are Birla Institute of Technology and Science Palani, Indian Institute of Technology Jodhpur, Indian Institute of Information Technology, Kota, Malviya National Institute of Technology, Jaipur, IIM Udaipur, AIIMS Jodhpur and LNM IIT. Rajasthan has nine universities and more than 250 colleges. There are 41 engineering colleges with an annual enrollment of about 11,500 students. Apart from above there are 41 private universities like Maharaja Ganga Singh University, Bikaner, Madhav University, Singhania University, Amity University, Jaipur, Mewar University Chittorgarh, OPJS University, Churu, Modi University of Technology and Science Lakshmangar Women's University, Sikhar, RNB Global University, Bikaner. The state has 23 polytechnic colleges and 152 industrial training institutes that impart vocational training. In 2009, Central University of Rajasthan a central university fully funded by Government of India, came into force near Kishangar in Ajmer district. Topic tourism Rajasthan attracted total 45.9 million domestic and 1.6 million foreign tourists in 2017, which is the 10th highest in terms of domestic visitors and 5th highest in foreign tourists. The tourism industry in Rajasthan growing effectively each year and becoming one of the major income sources for the state government. Rajasthan is home to many splendid travel attractions for domestic and foreign travelers, famously include forts and palaces of Jaipur, lakes of Udaipur, temples of Rajsamand and Pali, sand dunes of Jaisalmer and Bikaner, havelis of Mandawa and Fatehpur, Rajasthan, wildlife of Sawai Madhapur, the scenic beauty of Mount Abu, tribes of Dungarpur and Banswara, cattle fair of Pushkar. Rajasthan is famous for its custom culture colors, majestic forts and palaces, folk dances and music, local festivals, local food, sand dunes, carved temples, beautiful havelis. Rajasthan's Jaipur Jantar Mantar, Marangar Fort and Stepwell of Jodhpur, Dilwara Temples, Chitter Fort, Lake Palace, miniature paintings in Bundi, and numerous city palaces and havelis are part of the architectural heritage of India. Jaipur, the pink city, is noted for the ancient houses made of a type of sandstone dominated by a pink hue. In Jodhpur, maximum houses are painted blue. At Ajmer, there is white marble Bara Dari on the Anasagar Lake. Jain temples dot Rajasthan from north to south and east to west. 
Dilwara temples of Mount Abu, Srinathja temple of Nathdwara, Ranakpur temple dedicated to Lord Adinath in Pali district, Jain temples in the fort complexes of Chittor, Jaisalmer and Kumbalgar, Lodarva Jain temples, Mirpur Jain temple of Sirohi, Sarun Mata temple Kotputli, Bandasar and Karni Mata temple of Bikaner and Mandor of Jodhpur are some of the best examples. Kaoladeo National Park, Ranthambore National Park, Sarishka Tiger Reserve, Tall Chapur Sanctuary, are some of the best wildlife attractions of Rajasthan for every wildlife enthusiast. Mewar Festival of Udaipur, Tej Festival and Gangor Festival in Jaipur, Desert Festival of Jodhpur, Bridge Holi of Bharatpur, Matsya Festival of Alwar, Kite Festival of Jodhpur, Kolayat Fair in Bikaner are some of the not-to-miss fair and festivals of Rajasthan. See also Outline of Rajasthan List of people from Rajasthan Tourism in Rajasthan